Patent. I am the author of Google Drive and Docs. In 30 minutes, today I'm going to be talking about how to add a custom banner to your Google Sites page. Um, this works whether you're using a Windows PC, a Mac, or a Chromebook. Quick disclaimer, what you see here may look a bit different for you as Google updates its software and you are responsible for following uh, Google's terms as well as any local regulations that might apply here. So uh, where I usually get started when I'm working with Google Sites is actually in Google Drive. You can just, in the, in the uh, search window, you can just type Sites. It will show, it will show uh, you know, some recent ones. So I'm gonna use this one. And what I wanna do here is this is a very basic uh, Google site, it's intended for, you know, students who are in a, in a high school programming class. And you can see there's, you know, there's, there's three different uh, windows I have here. This is the area where I start editing content. And you, you may notice like, oh, this is a really ugly uh, banner behind video. And I, I want to change that. So there's a couple things you should know. First thing is, is that um, you can change the image and you can either select one of their stock images so they have a nice gallery of images. All right, let's select that one. Typewriter buttons. Uh, or you can upload something. And then the other thing you can do is you can change the header type. And this is useful if you want to maybe make this image look bigger um, or just have a title itself. Like if I just wanted that video, I could do that. But people like to dress it up to make it look good. So what I'm gonna do is I'm actually gonna upload, whoops, that's, the one, that's not what I wanted. Okay, let's go back here. I'm going to change the image. I'm going to upload an image. And actually, I have an image in mind. It is the Taj Mahal. It's in here somewhere. Here it is. And this is a this is a license. This is a Creative Commons licensed image that I can use. So I'm going to select that. It's just on my hard drive, and you can see it popped up here. Um, you know, by the way, if you're using images on a website, you should use images that you either have permission to use, or they're licensed for public use, or they're public domain. Um, so, so I've just put this here, and if I wanted to, I could just change the way it looks. Like, this is just a banner style. If I wanted to, I could make it a large banner, so you can see more. I could even make it a cover. So you might use a cover if there's maybe something important in the image that you want people to see. So I'm just going to use the banner style, which is shorter, and then below it I have my content. And I have other videos showing how to add content. Uh, if you want to learn more about Google Sites, I've covered briefly in my book, uh, Google Drive and Docs in 30 minutes, but actually I've created a lot of videos about it too. Um, so if you want to, just subscribe to me on uh, YouTube or search them out on my YouTube channel. If you have a chance, if you could like this video, that would be very helpful too if it, if it helped you out. Uh, this is Ian Lamont signing off. Thank you so much for watching.